Okay, we are in the navigation problems section of our workbook, and we're going to be doing a determining our set and our drift. So it is the combined effect of both our wind and current. We're trying to solve for a direction, which is our set, and a speed, which uh, is our drift. So you can see our answers here both have a direction and a speed. We're going to be working problem number one in the workbook. We are here on our maneuvering board, or our mo board as we call them. Um, so as before, we're working everything from the center. You can see the outer ring here has our directions in it. And then we have our, in this case, our speeds. We're racing this in one hour. So the first ring is our one, and then we have two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten is the outer ring. If we were doing more than ten knots, we'd have to use our scales, but we're not. So. Problem number one says we are on a course of 150 degrees true, turning for 6.2 knots. So that's our, our course and our speed through water. It then says our GPS indicates that our course over ground, or COG, is 130 degrees true with a speed over ground, or SOG, of 5.5 knots. What is the set and drift? So the first two numbers, that is what we think we're doing. The second ones are what we are actually doing based on our GPS. So... What we're going to do first is plot our 150 degrees out to 6.2 knots. So we find our 150 degrees. We're going to line up from the center. And we're going to run this out down the 150 to our 6.2. So right here's our 6. We're going to go up to 0.2. So 6, 0.2, just like that. Nice dark line. You can see that. Then we're going to do our 130 out to 5.5. So we're going to go from the center out 130 to our 5.5 right there. Nice crisp line. That was a little heavy. Hopefully you can see both of those. So we need to measure the angle between these two. So we're going to line up between the ends of these two lines right here. You can draw a line between them, or you can just line up with them. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna roll that back to the center. So here we are, <clears throat> here we are lined up, and lift, roll back to the center. And we're just a little bit more than zero, three, two, or about zero, three, three. We can probably get a little bit tighter on here. And that's a little bit better. Right there at zero, three, two, when I lined up a little bit closer here. So that's our set. Our drift is going to be the distance between these two points. All right, so distance between these two points, we go to the center. And we go out, you can see we're right at 2.1. So there's two, and there's one little tick past that, it's 2.1. So we're gonna come back here, we'll look at our answers. And we know answer A is 032 at 2.1 knots, and that is our set and our drift.